be a test for new software anyway, so I'm not really too worried. Uh, guys, oh, yeah, this is default and unlimited ammo. We're about to try the level 40 uh, stat. Uh, getting level 40 to get the uh, haste beetle. Because it seems like a lot of people are having trouble trying fine. to figure out how to do it online, so we figured we'd make this and uh, help you out. We're not going to try it, we're going to do it. Yeah. We actually did it before the nerf to it. So it was level, the level So we had to get level, level 45, 45, and we actually ended up getting it uh, at level 48 is what we ended up at the end of the game. Uh, so hopefully we can do that again. It's surprisingly easy. You'll, it, you're it, just it doing it It is actually surprisingly easy. Um, it does actually involve quite a bit of luck on whether or not you can actually get the cave. Somewhat, yeah. The cave a lot. Um, yeah. We'll just open up with our strategy. The strategy is go to the cave every time there's a cave. Yeah, pretty much. And then you win. Uh, you get... pretty, pretty much I recommend... Uh, he's just gonna... Like, always get Potion Brewer and Gatherer if possible, unless you get another good roll uh, with it. But uh, I'm gonna go Mage with a backup archery, and he's going full archery. I just use whatever leftover arrows he got, because it's good to... Because uh, uh, magic takes a while to get started, so I always start... Uh, I always do like a bow as a backup to kind of help me out in the early game until I get my uh, magic really going. So, uh, are you ready? Range combat's just a lot safer. Yeah, range yeah. combat's a lot safer than melee yeah, range combat. Range combat's a lot easier, a lot safer. It just has a really slow start, but it, it's probably one of the best in the uh, game. Yeah. Archery's more resource intensive. And then magic's. I don't know. What would you say about magic? Uh, magic I'll sucks. Think it sucks to start. It also requires a lot of luck because you gotta get the net and then uh, you also bugs. gotta get the right yeah. bugs. Uh, so, so that's kind of tedious. About doing, the thing about doing archery is that I'm always, like, smacking rocks to get arrows. <laughs> it's very yeah. resource intensive. Being a mage, if you do mage by yourself and not multiplayer, it's kind of hard to get started because you don't really have someone to sit there and smack everything for you. Also, I guess you're, I guess it's a little more dependent on what skills you get because you really need that mana regen ability. Yeah. It's weird starting with tools because I've only been playing pig folk lately, so... yeah. Actually, starting with an axe is really nice. And as always, the first level is always the hardest in the game to do. Yes. Um, but if you can, without getting killed, I'd recommend killing any creature you can, even though it takes forever yes. because you do no damage. You really need the uh, the items and stuff. Yes. Experience and gold helps a lot, and it's really, I mean, it's not that hard. Oh, I got you hit, and, and then you got me. Hit. Yeah, we well, just got each other hit. So this is this is a bad start already. But uh. Yes. Yeah, especially if you're... Oh, I actually died. <laughs> Wait, why am I going to do that? Oh, you're dead. Okay. Well, I'll come get you in a second. I'm making a, I'm making a pickaxe first. I have my priorities straight. I'm going to snack the slime. Oh. And my ancient axe actually gave me a dynamite... Or di diamondite great blade, which is a wow. great start, actually. So, uh... That's why the bats are overpowered and are the best companions. Yeah, I'm just going to use so it. They just give you bat. diamond blades oh, wow. just first level. And did you just uh, make that and equip that while you were dead? I did, actually. Because <laughs> your dead bodies legal the thing in there. Do. Ah, come on. I know, right? Tedious. But especially if you're doing the level 40, you need to kill everything, doesn't matter what it is. And even the pigs and, like, the slimes, even if you don't need it, just just kill it anyway and at least, at least get the experience. Uh, and and that's why I prefer... Oh, crap, what was I going to say? I don't know. That's why I prefer extra attack stats for the first first couple of levels. No matter if I'm doing what my end game plan is, I want extra attack to make the first couple of levels go by easier. Yep, and even though even if you're gonna be a mage set like what I'm doing, I'm planning out being a mage, you may just have to uh, bite the bullet and just deal with being like melee for a while until you can actually start getting going. Yeah, no matter what, you have to figure out how to smack things with your tools. Yeah. Or whatever random objects you're carrying, because you don't. I got a di Oh, I yeah. got an iron blade. I got to make an iron pickaxe. Nice. I'd actually never recommend hitting anything with a tool, a monster, yeah, unless it has plus attack, because yeah, it degrades the durability. So I mean, if you're holding a piece of wood and you're holding an axe, don't smack it with the axe because it doesn't have any bonus attack. Just smack everything with like a ham or something. That includes grass. Uh, grass yes. also wastes durability. Oh, look. Oh, gold blade. Ah, oh, you got. It. Yeah, it's mine. <laughs> so this is actually a pretty lucky start. We already started with, uh, we already got good pickaxes. And even though we're playing multiplayer, pretty much everything we're saying applies to single player too. Yeah, I mean, if you're trying to do a real, really good strategy, and you're not just kind of playing just to have fun and like screw around, what I, I would always recommend the ancient bat just because it giving you random anything is 
amazing in the game. Super good. Yeah, you can just kill him with your giant axe. Uh-oh. Uh, usually I find playing with default here, it actually makes the game harder, because if one of us screws up, it will commonly kill the other one. Like that. Yes, yeah, so now he's in a very dangerous spot because of that trap. So it might be hard to get him out of there. And if I do get him out of there, I'm going to take damage for it. But then again, also on the other hand, if I do get him out of there, that makes it a little easier for him, because he's doing solo, he'd just be dead. Yeah. That free start. Yeah, multiplayer is always the easiest way to do any of the challenges. Uh, it kind of ruins the difficulty of it. Uh, unless, you're doing, unless you're doing no hit mode, unless you're trying to get the overworld helm, and you are the guest. If you're not the host, that is impossible. Because you'll have just a single lag, just any amount of lag, anything might get you hit. So that actually makes it more difficult. I would recommend doing that on your own. And, oh, uh, host. But there are actually some challenges that are easier, a lot easier. Yes. Because um, some of the things don't affect the second them. player. So, yeah, which is unfair. Yeah, like, we'll just we'll just say you can exploit it. Yeah, we did a uh, we did a run with a scourge mask and oh, sure. uh, unlimited took no damage the entire time from the scourge mask, but I was taking damage every uh, two minutes just like it was planned. Which again is only really playing with the scourge mask. I found it only really affects the first few levels because after that you have a bunch of health and healing potions, so you don't need to worry about it. Yep. And these green slimes are great, because they drop herbs. And then I just gave it a hug and took damage for a reason. God, <laughs> So so bad at this game. I need to be getting more more trees. So many more sticks. Oh, look at that. I got a gold great blade for you, Sean. Oh, nice. You make me a nice, nice pretty gold axe. Yeah, there you go. Also, I got a diamond bar, too. So we're getting pretty good stuff already. No. Which kind of feel like ruins the whole difficulty level of this, but, uh... Yeah, that's what I said, yeah, the bats, bats are strong. Yep. Wow, I'm pressing all the wrong buttons over here. And if you are trying to do the level 40, uh, as much as you may want to because it's easy, don't go to the grass biome as yeah. much as possible. Always go with the hardest, like, I mean, it's going to suck, but sometimes you just kind of got to do it or else you're not going to get enough experience. So, uh, obviously, the swamp over the forest... Is going to be Unless the best you're option. really confident, it's going to kill you. I just oh, I lost the iron bat. Why did you do that? <laughs> That's a. It? it dropped an iron ore like right when I went in the door. Oh, that kind of sucks. A Not a huge deal. It's iron ore, but still, it would have been nice. Sucks. Hey, uh, come here. I got some herbs for you. I bet you do. Oh yeah, tasty herbs. Yeah, another reason why it's always better to do it in multiplayer is because uh, one of you can like take gather or something, and the other one can take potion brewer, and it just makes it a hell of a lot easier. Yeah, you can split up the skills, yeah. Some stones for you. Uh... Did you get any string or monster pelts? Here's a pelt, and then here's a potion. Fantastic. Do you, have any, do you have any hides? I do actually have seven hides. Arrows. Arrows for days. Nice, and I can make iron armor out of that. Nice. Can you make fire? Make... Yeah, can I can make, make fire. You can make a fire. Also, you don't really need that much food. If you have, like, 20 cooked food, you're... Yeah, that'll pretty Probably much get you throughout the rest here. of the game, yeah. The fire has a nice little bug where sometimes when you right click on it, it just won't do it. You'll eat the meat yeah, instead. You just eat food. <laughs> you just eating poop. Eating poop. You, you eat and then poop, you do not eat poop. <laughs> uh, okay. Um, hey, there's a diamond ore over here you can get. Hey, and a fire bug, I don't need that. I bet there's a diamond door. No, I don't have enough money right now. Oh, well, conveniently enough, I do. Where's, where's the lair man? He's right here. Here, uh, you already have some, so just carry that. Oh, thanks. Oh, I need to make a hat. Hat's more stylish. Oh, and by the way, if you're gonna be a mage, I would always recommend being the remnant, not the noble. But... He has whole, not the, gotten it. This whole 20% chance, I feel like, is a little fraudulent, because we have beaten the game at least a dozen times, and that is still the only thing left in the game I have left to get. Took me probably 40 tries to get the Batwing visiting caves all the time. Yeah, it's it's a little ridiculous sometimes. Uh, so I'm stuck being the Noble, which only gives you plus one magic instead of, what is it, plus three? And I don't start with a wand, which sucks. Yeah, you don't start with a lightning wand. You ready to go yet? What are you doing over there? I don't know, I'm actually just kind of talking. Oh, I got the wolf. The wolf sucks yeah. here. Have some wolf. I actually didn't level up. The wolf up. can push your call partner, which is fun. And yeah, also it pushes the shop owners, no as you can see. It, it's pretty entertaining. It'll also kill other things. It's not very... Uh, which yeah. we, forgot, uh, we forgot to kill the chickens to get the... Uh... Oh, yeah. 
Be Although last time, when we actually did this level 45 run, we did not kill the chickens for the extra experience. So I think we'd still be fine. Ooh, I fucked that up. Ooh. Also, you don't need wood. After, like, the first level... Yeah, ah, pretty much if you just get enough uh, wood in the first level, you really you really don't need it ever again. Ooh, hello. If you're doing an archer, you need a bunch of sticks. You'll need some sticks to make oh, what? tools you just got owned. But just wood itself is pretty much useless. God, I'm, I'm looking like a noob now. I'm like taking so it's much you. damage. Okay, it happens. I never, I never take this much damage. Let's get here for you. Doing it with a friend. Yeah. Now I'm just poor choice. Oh no. Wait, I have arrows. I don't know why. Wow, I'm just he's, he's not like jumping arrows. around. Yeah, I don't know why you're not either. Cause I got like 50 stone arrows. I got the first level. That's a lot for the first level. Hey, don't forget to let me know when you get strings, because I need a uh, net still. No strings. Oh, and I got the focus skill, or the clairvoyant skill, which is like, oh, probably the best skill in the game. It's the necessary one for doing magic. Yeah. I mean, if, if you don't get it, uh, it makes being a mage really, really hard, because you just have to like chug health, or, uh, mana pots nonstop. You get the potion. You only just kill. Okay, you go. I don't drink potion. I don't like having three health. Do you need a potion? Not a potion for you, Mister. Getting killed. Oh, shut up. Ah! Rock spider. Yep. They're scary. Yes. Ooh. Oh, there's another one. I don't know why that one went that way instead. You have a potion. Get, get over here. I'm trying to. I'm trying to help you. I don't need your fucking pity. Uh, here are some rocks. Charity. Rocks. I got another gold grape blade. No, well, we don't really need it. I want to upgrade my axe out of convenience, though. So I, can chop so, so I don't chop so many trees. I can oh, just your chop. axe. Okay. Yeah, my, my wood cutting axe. And that's all in this level. I guess now oh, we have to do forest, which kind of sucks. So that's yep. level three. Oh, yeah. And also, dodge wear all the time, because it's super fun. Yeah. Hey, what do you got for me? I, I have no, belts. I, I have some leathers, a few leathers, and that's it. No strings? Do you get any strings? Oh, actually, I have no string. Never mind. Make a fire. Boom. And uh, don't forget to save some pelts so we can make a leather so we can get a drum, too, for the end of the game. Oh, yeah, the drums. We're going to try this out. We should probably make at least one for each of us for when we actually fight the Scourge. Well, it's not like we've ever needed it, but... Yeah, but we might as well just make it kill faster. And I can make more iron stuff, woo. Also, one thing about playing a mage, uh... Monster pelts seem to be really hard to come by, or like, more rare than any of the other resources to make stuff. So, I typically don't waste it on arm or on iron. I don't make iron mage equipment, I just wait until I, uh... can make either gold or diamond. So like right I just here. use what I got because leather usually isn't as hard to come by. Yeah, leather is pretty easy to come by. I typically don't bother with the shield though because that rarely comes into effect. The extra health character, a little bit of extra health, usually doesn't come into effect. Yeah, I usually don't. And then if I am using a shield, it's going to be a Riven Rest scale, which you just pick up from the dungeon anyway. Yeah, and if you're doing a level 40 playthrough, you'll probably want to go to the dungeon as much as possible because yes. all the guys there drop a lot of experience. Unless the cave's available. Yeah, the cave is always the best. Always get the cave if you can. Yeah. Should be hopefully we'll be able to show that unless we just don't have any cave spawns, that'd be pretty sad. Yeah, that would be pretty sad. When we when we did it and got level forty eight, to be honest, we got like four or five cave spawns in a row, which is pretty lucky. Yeah, we had a lot of cases. Pretty yeah. unbelievably lucky. Oh you have a gold pick actually so you gotta get this. Oh yeah. And also I've decided that these boars are actually bulls. They're bulls, alright. Because the minotaurs, like in the dungeon level, have the same behavior. So they're just like it's like they were bulls in the forest, and they went to the dungeon and they evolved into minotaurs. Oh, yeah, that's that's a really complex bio. Yes. <laughs> that was a thought I had earlier. If you have a bow, don't be afraid to shoot the rocks. Just yeah, to check it for might, it. it might save your life. Uh, oh, actually, if you're aware that it is a possibility when you approach the rock, you should be fine, because they jump out at you before you reach them. Yeah, or just like walk to the rock, always swinging your... your uh whatever you're holding, and yeah, it shouldn't be a problem. 
But if it's not Rock Slider, you can just pick your arrow back up. I just realized I got a bunch of shit for you I forgot to give you, like, while we were in town. Oh, yeah, I think your vile poisons and your mushroom. I don't want any of that. I didn't. I know, I, I, everything I you needed, I gave you, I put to the right of you. Or to the right of me. Everything oh, okay, I'm just picking up everything you're dropping. Yeah. I don't need these ones. Where do these even come from? I need to get some bugs. So, yep. Trash pile. Ooh. And more wood. Mostly for the sticks, don't really need the wood. Snap that pig. Yeah. Well, the pigs are heroic and like to take the bullets for their for their more aggressive comrades. Alright. <laughs> eh. Oh my god, the bee did not move like I expected it to. And that's the problem with the bees is that they move very kind of erratically. Oh, so good. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's right. Get out of your stone traps. There's lots of leather right here for you. Level 1 strats. Level, so you can, you can get it. Level one Ow, what the fuck? <laughs> you just jump into it? No, I, I jumped and like clipped onto the corner of the platform. Oh. Which, uh, by the way, if you do that, it like forces you into like another direction. And it forced me into the direction of the, uh, the thing, and it hit me. Luckily, we have some caves over here, so we can do the cave and get mad experience. I have so many arrows. Jeez. Jeez. I have I 113 have, stone arrows. Have, we'll have some more stone, then. Uh, I didn't get a single bug. I think I just, like, walked past bugs and kind of forgot to get them. That happens. Happens. So you don't need string anymore? Uh, no, I don't. Oh, well, it's gone, so I'll be with that. Yeah, like, like I said mushroom. at the start, even though I'm know I'm gonna be a mage late game, I built a uh, bow and arrow just because I have 39 iron ore, and so I can just have like a little backup stockpile of stuff until I get my mage wand off the ground. And here I got a bunch of uh, herbs for you too. No oh, more potions, beautiful. And here and I have a gold pickaxe now. Nice. I I'm about to buy. I'm about to make a diamond, diamond armor. Nice. And iron axe. All right. How much gold do you have? The man I'm talking to. How much gold? The money? Seven hundred and three. No. Gold. Gold ores. Resource. Here, have some gold ores. Yeah, I have uh, four gold ores. Make yourself something pretty. I already have a hat. Yeah, gold hat. I got myself a shield just for shits and giggles, because I have so much iron. Well, I'm just make those into arrows. Uh, I'm making them into arrows. Okay, well, you make them into arrows then. I'm making them into arrows. Alright then. There's some iron. I need iron. Actually, I, I can use some iron. Do, 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 do. There, I have 95 iron arrows. I will never use that many, ever. But uh, usually, what I do is once I get a nice little stack of like higher level arrows, I just give them to to unlimited and yeah, because he does more damage. I do like twenty dam or I do like five damage. Yep, half. I do half the amount of damage. That's him. And that's a mimic. Mimics have little tongues. You can see on the on the right. Uh. But unfortunately, with the rock spiders, there is no, There's no, no way kill. I've I've seen. Yeah. Oh no, it's a bat. Bats are scary. Oh god. Yeah, the bats are bats are really obnoxious because they tend to move really fast and are kind of hard to predict with their movements. Yeah. And by the way, as a mage, I hate the ice wand and I never make them. They're useless. Yes, we've seen. Yeah. Oh, they're, they're not very good. I'm just there. You go pee pew. Ah. And, and now okay, so here's the whole reason we're here is well, smashing the eggs. Yeah, when you get into the caves, uh, smashing the eggs is what causes the the big spider to spawn. But Pretty I would hilarious. recommend only doing it maybe one, maybe two at a time because you can get overwhelmed. No, quickly. I'm just smashing them all. I don't care. And I don't have a wand yet, so this is gonna be pretty much unlimited. And then we got two Boom, of them. Got it. We got two. Of them I like already. responsibility. Yeah, well, this one's pissed off at me, so I'm gonna smack a couple times with this axe while also, it while it bites. Also, you do have magic. Face. 
The big benefit of magic is that it goes through walls in the ground. Yeah. But you have to be careful not to kill the enemy off off the map, because then the experience can just get stuck where yep. you can't reach it. And then that messes up your and entire I, I'm just missing here. all my shots, that's cool. Yep, see, that was good. And then see, this up here and up here and smash that. Just run around and basically be an asshole and smash everything. That's how you, uh, say you get to level uh, 40. No problem. You dropped a gold uh, ore back there. This is a I real like chest. It. Which, if you feel like being an ass and exploiting it, if you're playing multiplayer oh, yeah. and you both stand on the chest at the same time, you both hit the chest at the same time, sometimes it duplicates the items. Did you get a key? I did get a key. Yep, it duplicated the key. Yeah, see? And whatever else is. So, it does that sometimes. Oh, the keys are useless. I mean about that. Yeah, I don't know why I didn't just do it to that one, because I just got a ring of nature, which would have been really good for Unlimited. But I don't need it, so I'm just going to give it to him. So he needs to get, get his ass over here so I can give oh, it to him. Oh, no, there's a boss. We're even busy. Ooh. Oh, triple shot. I got a triple shot skill. So you shoot three arrows at the same time. Uh, here, I have the ring. No, drop this uselessness. Oh, my God. Oh, okay, just pick it back up. God damn it. <laughs> See, this is what I'm talking about. Sometimes it takes you a long time to get a get a wand going. Like this is ridiculous. Sometimes. Have you been getting the bugs? Have you been? Oh, I'm, I'm hitting all of the bug things, and we're probably about to have like three spider spawn because my wraith just killed a lot. Uh, make sure <laughs> you. Uh, something like this happens. Make sure you don't miss out on experience. You need to get every single small amount of experience. It doesn't matter what it is you kill. You need to just kill everything and pick up all of its experience. So we already got like how many levels have we got? We got like three levels this this floor so far. Yeah. Ow. I I just threw a poison mysterious potion at myself. Do you have any health potions? Yes, you should know better by now. I know. I'm, I'm taking some, away from you. I'm taking some massive damage, and this is a little embarrassing because I I never get this much of my ass kicked. Oh, hello. He's lying. He doesn't. No. Oh, that's a bat. Oh, you see that lag? That bat just lagged through the floor for me. So that's the kind of thing that can happen when you're not the host, and that can mess up an overworld run if you're trying to do that. Yep. That's the kind of thing I was talking about not not doing that. And yeah, you've got, got another spooter. Huh. It's another level. It is, it's just so... They just come. They just come to you at the cave. Yeah, all the time. Experience just flows like a river. Just so easy. Ooh, a fire starter. That's always helpful. That's Actually, I'm kind of low on food, so I'll need more. Oh, alright. And our cave. Another Perfect. Cave, so cave all the time, forever, and always. This, this is what we're talking about. Okay, I don't need food, so here you can just have the fire starter. Okay, well, I'll just use it. Let there be light. Don't need a pick handle. Here's some more leathers, I don't know if you need them yet. Uh, well, I don't have diamonds, so I just kind of gather them all until I have enough for diamonds, and then, and then I throw away the rest. There you go. You need iron, you need iron for arrows. Here you go, have the iron. Here's stone. Yay. And here's kind of a nice little exploit. Also, if you have something in your inventory, you basically get a free inventory spot. If you don't have any arrows equipped, you can pick up something and right-click it, into the arrow slot, and I just got an extra inventory space. Yes, also so like right, Yeah, so like right there, I just got 33 iron ores into my arrow slot. Uh, kind of choose come wood. Yeah, it's kind of a little cheap, but the only thing, <laughs> the only thing that's about that is if you have it sitting there, and then you pick up another one of that item, it doesn't add it to the stack. It'll create a whole new instance stack in your inventory. So that kind of sucks, but uh, yeah, I guess just don't do it then. <laughs> the way I see it. Oop. See, at this point, <sighs> Unlimited's going to do a lot of the killing for us because I still haven't gotten my wands yet. So all I can really do is just smack shit with my, uh, my axe, which some kind of, sometimes just gets old. And it's not always 100% the best possible strategy. Like right there, I got a firebug, so now I can, now I can finally place it, make a fire wand. 
now I can actually start doing doing stuff. You can now shoot enemies through the walls, which will be his primary when I let him kill things. Also, if I don't want to waste arrows, I'll let him do it. Yeah. Because mana regenerates naturally, he doesn't have to build mana. Yep. When I got to build arrows. Especially when I got the uh, focus oh. skill, or trait, whatever. Yeah, focus, yeah. Yeah, the only problem with the fireballs is it does break the spider egg, so if, uh, sometimes you'll accidentally break more spider eggs than you're trying. Because yeah, it just travels. It just travels forever. Yeah, it, it travels through the spider eggs. It doesn't stop them. So you can shoot one fireball and pop like ten spider eggs, and then that gets kind of uh, annoying. It can get, if you have that many, the brood are pretty easy to handle. But when there's seven of them on the screen, it's kind of it gets a little tricky. Yep. So now all I'm waiting on is getting another lightning bug for me to make a lightning wand, which I don't use very often, but it does have its certain uses. Every once in a while, yeah. it'll... See, like, right here? Oh, okay, thankfully that rock spider stopped it. See, I shoot one fireball, and it just breaks all of this. And now we're probably going to get, like, two or three. And so the light one is being able to shoot straight up and down through yep, walls see, and everything. Yeah, now, now, now we got two. Which, now we're doing crazy damage, and we don't even care, because we just murder them all. Yep. And level up. So that's what we're talking about. The uh, the range is, is stupid easy uh, in this game. Just slow start, but definitely... Yeah, first couple levels are difficult. Game. And we got two more uh, spiders behind us. Really? Yep. Oh, how's it going, guys? Ow. Well, that was. I got a little cocky there. It happens every once in a while. Which it happens to me all the time. I'm, ants. I like to think I'm cool. <laughs> and there's a little big experience right there we almost missed. Yeah. And uh, it's not a very widely known thing yet, yeah. but you can also make a, a battle drum, which increases your damage. It's a one-time use thing. To make it, you need a, a bug of any kind, and depending on which bug you use, it'll increase different stats. And to make the drum, it is a uh, wooden plank combined with a refined leather, and then it gets you a tribal drum, and then you combine the tribal drum drum with the gem, or the, not the, it doesn't like have to be the gem, it's the, it's a fire bug, not the gem, the fire bug. And it will uh, create it for the specific class. And then you use it, and it'll give you plus 10 whatever for, I think it's like 30 seconds or something like that. Which is uh, helpful for the Scourge boss. Like the final and boss all the fight. damage, all the damage is 1 to 1, so an extra 10 stat is an extra 10 damage. Yep. And then if you're like the archer, and you get the thing, that, like the triple shot, which doubles your damage, that's actually an extra 20 damage. Or you get the Fire Wisp that also does it, and combine that with a triple shot, you do, like, what, quadruple damage? Which is, which is stupid good. Yes. Uh, here's some more stones for you. Yeah. I just bought another the lightning bug the store, so now I got a uh, lightning. Here's a whole bunch of iron. Um, do you want my diamond actually, eggs? Do you have any bugs? Because I actually, actually have a drum. Uh, actually, I have five ice bugs. <laughs> okay, I'll make an ice drum, just to, like, show it off. What is that? Is that magic? Yeah. Should be mad right. I don't actually use the drums, so I don't know. That's only one nice bug. You only need one. Bug or the gem? It's a bug, not the gem. Oh, that, did, that was stupid. There you go. Use your, use your drum. Yeah, see, that's that's the drum. Drum of wisdom. Whenever I use it, it'll uh, increase my uh, magic. So I'm just gonna hold on oh, to okay. it. Do you want to buy this uh, diamond pickaxe? Uh, if you want to, yeah, go for it. I already. Oh, actually, I don't have a diamond pickaxe yet. I. I was gonna say, don't you need one? Yeah, I do. Did you buy one? That's... No, it's just the one in store. As you'll see, when we get to the last level, second player cannot see the mineral deposits. He cannot see the special shards, whatever deposits. So he can't. There's no point really to have a diamond pickaxe until. Yeah. Do you want my diamond uh, great axe? Because I'm about to sell it. If not, uh, no, I'll just have my little katana that I won't use. I'm actually probably just gonna sell because I have so many arrows. I don't need a melee weapon. Okay. And now that I have both my wands, I don't need a melee weapon at all. I guess I'm a bug net too because I got. Actually, no, I need to get another fire bug for him. So I'll keep that. Oh, how much diamond do you have? I have two diamond ores. Alright, uh, actually we can make a... Here, come here, you can make a diamond armor, because I got a couple oh. of those. Oh, thanks, buddy. Mm hmm How much gold do you have? Three gold ore. Okay. Well... Which I don't need, because I have gold and everything, so. Now that I have 255 iron arrows, I would normally give him my stack of iron arrows, but since I don't have a gold... Air, any gold arrows as a backup yet, I'm, I'm just going to have to keep them. So wait, 
Zone 5. Watch out. Is this, is this safe for you? What? What district is this? Is this? District, this is only District 11 and we're already level 27. Yeah, player two can't see the information for some reason. Uh, I, no, you should be able to. It's in uh, when you pull up your menu. Oh God, this, <laughs> this bad. Why? But uh, when you go to your inventory, it says it just says Zone Five, where it usually says the district. No shit. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I've never seen that because I've never been player two because he can't host for some reason. Yes. So uh, I've been hosting all the time, so I've never seen that. And uh, yeah, if you press R, it says it right there, District Eleven. Uh, for some reason, it, that's always lowercase. But from what I've noticed, it seems like the um, the name of the district is always unique. Not always saying, "Hey, there's a diamond, diamond uh, blade over here." Good thing I forgot to buy that uh, diamond pickaxe. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was planned. It was strats. Yeah, pro strats right there. Right. Yeah, but the point I was making is that what, we're not even halfway through the game. We're already level 29. Yep. Um. So this is probably the best strategy to do if you're playing with someone else. If you do this by yourself, I would probably actually recommend being a uh, archer because it seems like the archer is probably the best uh, class for solo play, just because it keeps you safe and it doesn't take long to get going like being a mage does, and it does a ton of damage. Especially if you have the dwarf, you start with a bow. So yeah, that too. Do you have a gold pickaxe? Do you want mine? I have a gold pickaxe. Yes. Okay. Oh no, ah, experience! Ugh, I'm a hero. Uh, I probably popped out with my fireball. That's another thing, you have to be careful with fireballs. As you go through the wall, you'll accidentally kill something, and then the experience will disappear before you even realize what went on, and then you won't get it. So, oh, I ran out of mana. You're so focused. I am very focused right now. I need six. I need six. Oh, okay. See, that was one of the, like, rare uses for the lightning wand, and he took it away from me. Here, yes. bam, lightning wand. It's because, that's one thing about the, one thing about the spells, they all follow Hello. a distinct pattern of fire. Whereas the bow, you just have free aiming, so you can shoot wherever. Yeah. I don't need a stone grape, get out of here. There's lots of spider eggs over here, so we're going to be able to, uh... Smash it, smash it. Yeah. I got a fire bug for you, too, by the way. Okay. Oh, 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 get wrecked. Yeah, you just like one shot that. See, that's that's a perfect example of how strong the uh, archer is. Yeah, it depends kind of on your skills, because I have the bonus decks and the triple shot, which are two of the best uh, skills. If I had the fire wisp instead of the wolf, then that would be perfect. And more cave. And yep, more caves. Every time a cave pops up, you take it. Mm-hmm. So you're already level 33. Level 33, and this is District 12. Uh, here's some more stones. See, told, you, told you guys, told you guys, it's easy. Yeah. Here's a. I don't know if you need pelt. There's a pelt. Uh, actually, I do, because I just realized I don't have enough pelts to make a diamond armor whenever we uh, get them. And here's iron for massive iron arrows. Here you go. Okay, let's see here. How much diamond and gold do you have? I have three gold, no diamond. No diamond. Actually, I just fucked up. I don't need a fire bug for you. It's a lightning bug I need, and I just sold my lightning bug. Because a fire bug makes strength, not dexterity. So oh, that was a mistake. <laughs> That's okay. We were not in any hurry. That just means I have to keep my bug net a little bit longer. Dun, 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 dun. So, I have 315 iron arrows, so I can actually probably Jeez. give you a majority of this. There, I'll just keep I'll just keep 78 and there you go. It's a very rich uh, very rich in arrows this run. I usually don't have this so many arrows. Yeah. Well, we did get pretty lucky with our starts with the uh the uh oh. See, that's probably going to kill some monsters, so I need to hurry up and run over here and get the experience and just let unlimited take care of the other things that are over there. Everything else in the world right yeah. now. Uh, can't make it. There you go. There's another firebug, unfortunately. I'm gonna smack this thing with my arrow. There you go. 
Arrows make decent melee weapons in a pinch. Actually, anything can make a decent yes. melee weapon in a pinch, to be honest. See, as you can see, I haven't even needed a monopot potion the entire game because of this focus skill. It is, it is indisputably the best skill in the game for the mage. It is really hard to do any good challenge run, you know, like we're trying to unlock something without it. It's almost impossible. Unless you have gatherers like every, and potions. Every green, blue, and red skills all have great skills and awful, awful, terrible skills. Yes. Ow. Kind of expected it to stop before yeah. it got to me. Okay, somehow you hit three bats with one arrow. Of course. Oh god, experience. Really good. See, that's a perfect example of what the fire wand can do and how it sucks, kind of. And smash eggs. And smash eggs. And we get dungeon this time. Uh, yep. So it's a chance to get us uh, some some equipment like yeah. shields. Mushroom Mushroom actually has a lot of monsters, a lot of enemies, but it doesn't actually give much experience per enemy compared to uh, dungeon, where they have few enemies, but they all drop quite a bit of experience. Especially if you get a skeleton king, whereas the mushroom doesn't have a boss. So typically, oh. uh. if you can't get cave, try to get a dungeon that has any kind of boss. Uh, like I did, yeah, uh, yeah. Any any boss level is the best. Oh God, no! That man, I just killed him. Right. Did but you? Uh, <laughs> I just accidentally smacked him in the back of the head with my bow. Did you have any more? Di did you get any diamonds that round? Uh, nope. I have not been getting diamonds. What about gold. I have five gold. Can I have it? Yes. I'm gonna start making some gold arrows. I'll get this gold axe full. Well, too. Like a gold regular axe? Yeah, wood, wood chopping axe. Okay. Right. Here, want my uh... <laughs> something to keep in mind if you are doing archery. There is no trees in the dungeon, so if you're short on arrows, that's that's gonna that'll be a problem. Yeah, get, get, get these arrows over here. I dropped my. Oh yeah, all these arrows. Uh, so many arrows. I have a heinous amount of arrows. I can just shoot arrows nonstop, which is kind of the point you want to be at. Okay, the dungeon is kind of challenging, so you gotta just be very careful. And what what is that you got? Ring of balance. Yep. Life bounce. Yeah, I know. Okay. Well, I guess I guess you can have two <laughs> rings and all this. Have, all this have done. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I got a shield. Perfect. Riven Rath scale. Riven shield scale. Gives you plus all stats. Yep. And here's a gin. It's basically a ring of balance, but uses a shield. Yeah. It should go without saying that that is obviously the best shield in the game. Because it's like the only I mean, unique shield. balls in the game. are monstrous. They destroy me frequently. I guess it's kind of a personal, personal deal if they're a problem for you or not. But for me, they they wreck my day. Yeah, I I don't typically have as big of a problem. I I frequently go through this level without taking any damage while he just like explodes all the time. <laughs> like I said, these wrecking balls, man, they they do things to me. Also, being the oh, it's starting to happen. Being the guest player, you can see. Oh, I yeah. I, balls begin I to just happen. jumped right into a. I just jumped right into a couple things there. And also, a big part of what makes this level challenging, which is like something you wouldn't think of, is that you open all these treasure chests, and then your inventory gets full of junk, and then you open a new chest, and you can't pick anything up because your inventory's full of junk. Yep, and we need that diamond ore. And you just dropped a bunch of good junk on it, so that's gonna be great. Thank you. Oh, oh. hello. Well, if you're so good, you, you, you got under control. I believe in you. Oh, I got two Riven Rest Scales, which I don't need, so I'm going to drop the other one. Combine okay. that into there. Throw that. Drop that. Snipe. Oh, oh murdered I everything. I this shit. Oh, I will get hit. Oh, 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 oh I didn't get hit. Yeah. Ooh, I did not realize that there was a third one there. I got a Ring of Life. Do you want a Ring of Life? Do you need health? Eh, not so much, but I can... Take it, I guess. Actually, I need potions right now because I've taken a lot of damage this, this round. Whatever, I'll just wear it. Boom, kill it. You got any potions? I find uh, potions. Uh, we're kind of short, but here's our potion. Cool. Like, if you're not trying to do like experience, uh, I'd always recommend going grass all the time if you can. The the forest biome, just because you just get a ludicrous amount of herbs, and conveniently enough, my bat just dropped one. 
Yeah, if you need healing potions, the forest is the place to go. Yes, the forest is the place to go. Far. Well, I'm having some weird lag. I was, hope you all saw that. Uh, I don't really need obsidian blade. Oh, oh, it was Arch going to shoot me. That's alright. If you can't be as good as I am, that's okay. You don't even feel bad about it. JK. Yeah, the uh, the archers in the dungeon are probably the biggest threat because they just like shoot you from like off screen, and it. they're really annoying. Get caves, cave, good experience. Yep, more caves. Okay, I got, I have a singular herb. Oh, thanks, buddy. Did you get any pelts? Oh uh, yes, here you go. I still need pelts. That's damn it. I still, I'm still short of pelts. What damage? You get any diamond? I have two diamond bars. Uh, I have five diamond ores, so I guess you can make another diamond thing if you want. Oh, yeah. Get over here. Do you need gold? There's gold. Here's one diamond. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Oh, God. I'm actually... Uh oh Actually what? I'm actually short on sticks. Really? Didn't you just yes. buy, like, a gold axe? Then? Oh, yeah, we were in the dungeon. We have now, but we just went to the... Went to the dungeon yeah. where there are no trees. And I still haven't been able to get you... A, another lightning bug. <laughs> So there's that. What do you need lightning book for? I already have one. I have a thunderbug. I picked it up. Oh, did you? Yeah. Oh, well, shit. I don't need my bug net anymore, then. I don't even really need to make those out of arrows, because I have so many arrows, but I did anyway. Yeah, I have uh, nine sticks I could give you, but... uh, That's fine. I'll just chop some cheese in the, in the cat yeah. in the cave. Let's go. I actually don't have hides. That doesn't happen very often. Actually, I don't need iron anymore because I have a massive amount of iron in stone arrows. So I need. Yeah, I, don't need I, I stopped so getting anymore. iron a couple levels ago. See, this is one reason why range is so easy. Is because like they have a very s small range where they actually start activating and start moving to attack you. And on some of the enemies, it's just a little overpowered because it's like such a small range, it's just too easy to kill them. You'll shoot them and they will ignore the fact that you are shooting them. Special sticks. Get sticks. Get oh, paid, there's a spider in here. And there's a small little secret too. The Zweihander, uh, if you're going melee, you can go like a melee mage. And if you combine it with a, a bug gem, it actually makes uh, what's called a fire, lightning, or ice brand. And it makes it increases it to 90 attack and 10 magic. And whenever you uh, attack, it does either the fireball or the lightning or ice, depending on what you do, with it, like the, the effect the wand makes. So that is uh, very good. And we got two spiders right now. That's okay, we'll just kill them. Uh, yes, we will. Get it. Get it, sons. Uh, but yeah, I got, I making... got an, uh, hand here. I got another, another, got it. another diamond blade, so I'm just gonna give you my old pickaxe. Oh, sweet. But uh, making, yeah, firebrand, ice brands. If you're doing melee, those are just great weapons. So you should just make those. Yeah, it's it's a lot, but I I take it over the jelly blade because the jelly blade only has ten more damage. But when you calculate in the the ten magic, it's actually the same, and then you don't have to lose the health to be able to to get it. Yes. Although your your magic's not gonna be very impressive if you're probably doing a warrior, but. Yeah, it's still but I mean, 10 magic gives you 10 damage for every yeah. attack if you do the fire. So I'd always recommend trying to do the fire one, because it always shoots yes. straight, so it's always a guaranteed hit. So that's uh, increased 10 damage, so then it does the exact same amount as the Jelly Blade, but uh, doesn't make you lose health. And it is it just, harder to get the Jelly Blade, though, because you have to find Zweihander and make a gem, versus yep. just killing a Jellyfish and getting a Jelly Blade. Yep, this is a lot of, a lot of like ant things in a row. There's also a spider behind you. I know I see that, but I, th okay. I was hoping you were going to take care of it. Well, he flew- Ah! You can't shoot under uh, under floors. Nope. And now there's both of them, and they crawl, and then we shoot them. It's, it's pretty simple. Yeah, see? Pretty simple. Well, level 42! So what's the new what's the new f uh, requirement? Level 40? Uh, yes, it is 40. So there, we yes, are- already got it. We're in District 18, so we still have one more level left, and we're level 41 now. See, guys? It's not that bad. Yeah. I don't know if we'll beat our record of uh, 48, but we're we're there. I didn't get any diamonds. 
Oops. I didn't get any hides. I might actually finish without gold gold equipment. You mean diamond equipment? Diamond equipment's on a minute. Oh, I I figured you had enough hides, so I've actually been selling them. So I apologize. <laughs> I, I no. guess I, I guess I should have checked about that. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm missing. Uh, I need to make a. I, I need to replace my null. Oh yeah, your null. Gold okay. gold leather body armor is called null for some reason. I uh, I still only have three pelts. I, I still need another three pelts if you get them. All right. Somehow I ended up with iron anyway, so I'm just gonna throw it on the floor because I don't care. Hey, iron. I'll take it. Make arrows. Just there you go. Whatever. Massive numbers of arrows. There's another diamond ore over here, so now I got two bars worth basically. All right, let's let's go. <laughs> do 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 do. do. Diamond bar, nice. Ooh, I got a ring of ring of wisdom, which is really good. Actually, that's exactly what I need. Yeah. Nonsense, at me. Popcat. See, even though we're level, still level forty-one, I am still going to get all the experience that we can. Just, uh, just see how I'm I can going get. to avoid getting hit in the face from these wrecking balls. Yeah, good luck with that. That is my primary objective here. I got a monster pill in that chest. Ah, uh, because the duplicating wrecking balls are real. Oh, uh, they're doing it again? Yes. Oh, that, that sucks. It makes it very challenging for me. It's okay, okay. Right here, I'm a mage, but at this instance, it's just easier to shoot that gin with arrows than it is with magic, so I just... Oh god, I just, I just sat there and took both of those. Oh my god, I just took some damage. I got hit by one and just, like, fell into the other. I'm gonna get this experience still. Whoo! Juke all the balls. And there's not really anything these these you know, chests could have. have. Except for a ring of insanity. Yeah, <laughs> which is like maybe a couple of hey, things. So I have a... Uh, you want this uh, ring of balance then? Because now yes. i got two uh, uh, magic rings. Yeah. Yeah. So I don't need this ring of life anymore. Get out of your ring of life. Experience? That we just there's a kinda lot of wrecking balls going around here. Looked up on. Is that just a gin, or is that a is that a big guy? Well, this is a ginny, and I'm. This is very strange. I think I did I disconnect. Uh, yeah, actually, you did. Oh, I totally disconnected. That is highly unfortunate. All right, do you want me to just let you let you finish? Eh, I, I guess. I mean, you can kind of just hang out and see if it's still uh, and see if you reconnect or something. Right, well, until I don't start one of the silly things that happen when you disconnect. You shoot this guy. And he dies, but now he's just flashing, and the damage stays there. Same with this guy over here. I go over here, and I go indoors, but it doesn't really matter. Because <laughs> I can't see, I can't see default anymore. He's disappeared. Because I've disconnected from. So well, well, that's, well, that's incredibly funny. Sometimes it's kind of annoying considering we just did this, you know, almost hour-long video, and now it's just all wasted for him. So now his viewers won't be able to see. It's not wasted. Yes his awesomeness, but uh, at least he helped me make mine. And so at this point it doesn't matter what door I choose because it's about to be the end. Uh, so you actually need to leave the game now so I can progress. Oh yeah, so you can't actually leave while yep. I'm still in the game. So yep, I, I can't progress into the next level while he's still in the game, so I, I got quit. to... Uh... There you go, I quit, I'm out. Okay, and... Are you and that, sure? that was my part done. I'll see you later. You sure you're 100% out? Yeah, I can't like you doing Because it's not letting me... Oh, now it's letting me continue. That was... I was about to scare me there for a second, because it, uh... That would be really important. Well, you can just stay here and just keep talking for shits and giggles. Yes, I... of course I will. I'm going to I'm gonna cuss a lot, and then say, like, racist things, and then you have to put an age rating on your video. That age uh, game. would actually be kind of sad, actually. I... <laughs> It'd be very depressing. For and sure. guess what? I figure I ended with one monster pelt short of being able to make a diamond armor. That sucks. Yeah, it does suck, actually. But, uh, that's fine. That's fine, we can do this. <sighs> oh, whatever. There's not a monster pelt for sale. So, and I don't have any... I don't have any health potions, so I got 14 health. Kill the Scourge, I'm gonna regenerate some mana. 
before I go do this. I, see, I, I have massive magic damage. 74 magic. Uh, because of those rings. So I'm going to be doing a ton of damage against the Scourge. Uh, so when you're doing the Scourge level, uh, I'd always recommend, obviously, killing everything. Like always. And get a Diamond Pickaxe. You need a Diamond Pickaxe to be able to get these little crystals. If you've never done that yet, it actually, uh, you combine them, and uh, you shoot it like an arrow, and each shot does 150 damage to the Scourge, uh, which is it's, incredibly... It's not necessary, but it's convenient and expedites the whole battle. Yes, it does make it go by a lot faster. Um, um, and if I'm a mage, or even a, with an archer, I always shoot my arrows and stuff everywhere all the time my magic just because there's worms and the worms you can actually hit while they're invisible underneath the ground and so it just instead of them popping up and just surprising you you can just kill them. That is particularly important if you're doing an overworld run and don't get surprised by yeah, a worm that's hiding on the ground. They will surprise you and ruin your entire thing. Like right there, see that worm just kinda popped up and uh... didn't really, wasn't really, I mean almost killing me but it was, it was just there being annoying. And uh, for the Scourge level, uh, I always just ignore the Scourge. I just go through and clear the level first so I can collect all these crystals, get a little more experience if you need it, and then you don't have to worry about trying to kill monsters also while you're backpedaling away from the Scourge um, while you're trying to kill it. This just makes it a lot easier to, to, to manage. Yeah, because by the time you get to the end of the level, you turn around, you have plenty of room. Scourge moves really slow, so you have plenty of room to catch back up to him and kill him. Yep. And see, this is where being a mage is super helpful, because I'm just clearing out this massive line of enemies, and it's like no big deal. Keep shooting fireballs, and they're all dead. And I can just regenerate mana. So no, it's absolutely no problem. Okay, switch ones. There we go, kill everything. And right here, I'm at the end of the game. So now, I will combine these thingies. And put them in my heart, my hotkey bar list thing, whatever you want to call it. I'll put my, uh, put my drum up there too. Now I just gotta run backwards to the Scourge. And, uh, now shoot this thing 12 times with these little light arrows. And generate more magic, and you, while you're doing that, you just gotta dodge, dodge his balls. That he's shooting at you. It's okay, really so easy to I'm avoid out. his balls. So I use the battle drum, have increased magic, so now I have 85 magic. And as you can see, I'm just doing 95 damage a hit to the Scourge, which is a massive amount for being able to endlessly spam it because of the clairvoyant skill. And he moves slowly and shoots his balls in yep. predictable patterns. So yep, it's and easy. they're very easy to dodge as long as and you just sit here and keep regenerating magic and just keep shooting them in the face. And yeah, that's that, why and, you yeah. kill all the enemies. Now yeah, once you kill all the enemies behind him. Makes it easy. Yep, so now he's dead. We ended up level 43, as you can see up here in the corner. Uh, very easy. Just kill all the spiders, be ranged, preferably with a friend, potions, gatherer if possible. If you're good and you can do it melee, go ahead. That's fine too, but yeah. <laughs> recommended to range. Yeah, I mean, you totally can do it. Uh, melee, kill spiders. melee is useful in certain circumstances if you do certain challenges, like the floaty slime is, uh, I, yeah, I mean, you pretty much have to do it because you can't, can't get sticks to make wands or arrows. Uh, so when I did the floaty slime, I had to go melee with the firebrand uh, best uh, thing. So uh, here's a quick little tutorial. If you guys have any questions, feel free to send me a message. Uh, my name is Default Settings, and that is Unlimited Ammo, the one that dropped. So uh, thanks for watching, guys, and uh, hope you liked the video. Thanks.